Good morning, Captains. I'm Alex Dorsey. And I'm Nick Ionel. Today is Friday, March 24th, and we're coming to you with another episode of WK Today. Seniors, there are several scholarship opportunities for you, but the deadlines are quickly approaching. Please see the flyers posted outside Miss Ankoviak's office for more information. This is some, not something that you want to miss out on. March 28th and 29th, the Captain's Corner is holding a Easter Egg scavenger hunt. In order to enter a raffle, you must post a selfie with all four eggs and tag at CCWKHS on Twitter. The first, pri the first place prize is a $25 gift card, and the second place prize will be a $5 gift card. And third place will get two cookies. Good luck to those who participate. Now let's kick it over to Lilia for sports. Today for our Captain's, girls soccer takes on Milford High School at Milford. JV starts at 5.30 and Varsity takes the field at 7.00. On Saturday, Boys Varsity Track takes part in the Huron Relays, while the Boys Lacrosse team face Stony Creek at Mott. JV plays at 11 a.m., followed by Varsity at 12.30. There will be a mandatory football meeting for all players on Tuesday, March 28th at 2.30 in rooms 101 and 103. Every player needs to bring 25 email addresses for the fundraiser. Emails should be extended family members or those who might donate money to the program. Any questions, please contact Coach Schmidt. That's all for sports. Now back to you at the news desk. Many of us here at Kettering not only put a full day of school, but then we also go to our jobs. So how is that we all manage it? We caught up with a few that had hard workers at Kettering to find out. I work at Kroger and I've worked there for about nine months now. I work at Boston Market. I've worked there for about 18 months or so. Oh, I'm the manager of Boston Market. It's like I have to oversee the entire crew. So the whole crew can be good, but if the dishwasher's having a bad day or not doing things the right way, that affects me and I can get in trouble for that. So it's more it's more responsibility, I guess. I balance school and work by making sure I don't work too often. I work about four days a week and I make sure that I always leave enough time for homework. My bosses are extremely flexible and understanding about my school life. They know that it's important and it's something that I need to get done. And I usually work 24 hours or like 22 depending. Um, for the week, I only work three days during the weekday. I'll work from like 3 to 11. And then during the weekend, I'll work Saturday and Sunday. I'll open from like 8 to 3. I would suggest um, making sure that they're not going to overbook you and that they're not going to make you work until like 11 o'clock at night and make sure that you work as a priority at school and if you need help with something or you don't understand something missed homework the night before, ask the teacher for help. Well, I mean, I've never really had like the hottest grades, but like, I didn't fail or nothing, I got like B's. Yeah, there's been two times last semester where I like told them I was like, I have too much homework, I'm not coming in. And they were like, yeah, no, it's understandable, it's fine. And they let me call off, but I mean, I've never had an issue. Yeah, they're always pretty nice with stuff like that. Um, obviously school is more important. So if your job is affecting your grade greatly, you should probably avoid having a job or ask your boss to have less hours. I mean, there's a couple times where it's like, you know, I'm at work and I'm like, I know I got homework and I know I'm going to be tired when I get home. I'm like, I just don't want to do it. I don't want to be up late. So then I'll just go to bed and I'll worry about it before the class. It's all about finding what works best for you. If you have any old shoes laying around, the Senior All Night Party Committee is doing a collection. Simply bring the old shoes to the Dropbox in the office to help the All Night Party and those in need. Donations will be accepted until April 30th. It's Friday and you know what that means. Here's our Captain of Kettering for the week. My name's Cal. I'm Cal Lamar. No, Cal's unique and not a lot of people have it, so let's stick with it. I'd wish for a billion dollars. I'd wish that I could live a long and healthy life without any major problems and I wish for all my friends like success and like health with their family like nobody should have to go through cancer or anything. I love, I love riding my dirt bike and I uh, love hanging out with my friends. Dessert has to be raspberry cheesecake all day. Friends because without friends I'm not myself I'm, I'm just wandering through life lost but I don't know um yeah, let me think about that one. 
If you know someone that should be nominated, please let us know in room 503 during fifth hour. Well, that's all we have for you today. Once again, I'm Nick Ionella. And I'm Alex Dorsey. Have a great weekend.